<coughs> oh man. Hello, hello. <coughs> oh, man. How you guys all doing? What's up, what's up? Should be ending in about an hour. Less than an hour now. He's all right. It's been a little bit tired, but you know, we'll manage. We'll manage. Oh, man. Six pounds, thanks, thanks. Dun, 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 dun. Extended by thirty minutes? No, it was not. It was not extended. It's the same time. No extension here. I did see the solar eclipse. So Texas um, got the uh, you know whole experience is what uh, my brother was talking about. But I got to see the whole thing. Um, like a little video of it it got super dark and then super uh super dark and then it got super bright again i don't know if you guys can see it but do you see that little moon thing and the, it was covered by the clouds half the time a little bit did you guys see that thing kind of see it But uh, it, it went on for like um, maybe like two, three minutes. Yeah. Yeah, but it was it was cool. It was a cool experience. It's like an experience that. Not a lot. I don't. I don't think it's gonna happen for a Welcome very long time. Welcome to the time, Ace right? Mine training system. When you are ready, initiate the link. All right. Well, let's play some game before we uh, before we get started. This is called Blue Something. I don't know. I forgot what it's called. Gosh, bless. Excuse me. Yeah, it's not going to be for a while, so it's the cool experience we got to see. Well, let me know if the update goes live a little bit earlier, guys. Um, but I'll be playing this game for a little bit. It's called Bl uh, Blaze uh, Blue. Antroph Antrophy? Yeah. Effect? Audio bridge activated. To protect your auditory nerves, please confirm the sensitivity. Sure. Now please move to your right. I don't play Honkai Star Rail anymore. Jump to get on the stairs. You can jump twice consecutively while you are airborne. That's nice Dash graphic. To dodge traps or enemy attacks. <laughs> press down plus jump to drop down from a platform. When you are attacking an enemy, press and hold a 
While dashing, press attack to lose dash attack. While airborne, press attack to use airborne attack. Your skills can help you handle multiple enemies. Your Evo type's HP is low. We suggest you use an HP mixture. You can now configure the keybind settings. How do I configure it? Oh, I gotta edit it. Oh, shit. You've completed the I'm tutorial, good. taking you into the world of Ace now. Can you hear me? I mean, that's how it works, right? I got you again. <laughs> Any other game that I've uh, I played Hello, other than Isa. Cookie Run? I am from the skies. Right now, Gotcha Game. I'm, I'm playing um, AFK Starting Journey now, and Astra. Knights of Veda. You just have to proceed with your mind training the usual way. I'll keep track of your progress and get back to you when the time is right. It's as easy as that. I'm glad to be your partner. <sighs> Hello, Acer. Please move to your right for a mind training session. What the? This is me? Good. You've completed your first training. Hello, Acer. I'm an administrator of the world of Ace. You can call me I.O. Congratulations on finishing your first tutorial. Take this analyzer. It will help you unlock the prototype. You've obtained the first analyzer. Now, it's Blaze Blue. Uh, Trace. What is it called? The first prototype. Blaze Blue Entropy Effect. Project Ace aims to strengthen the minds of the citizens of once again the mind. Whoa. Please activate the training terminal. Click video below to learn more about each prototype. Once you've selected a prototype, hold unlock prototype to unlock it. Oh, there's a lot. Hibiki, Koha, Laguna Zagurato Echi. Noe Ramuda S. Taokaka, Jin, Kisaragi, Kokono, Jin, Kisaragi. Man, I can't see the weapon. I want to see the weapon. Hakume, Mai Natsume, Hakume. Oh, I can see? No. Let's see here. Oh, I can. Okay, nice. My Natsume. The spear. Oh, this is so much. This is the one that we used earlier, I think. Gun. Sign. Giant sword. What are you? Jin Kisaragi. Long sword. Sword. I kinda wanna use a gun or a giant sword. Let's use a giant sword. Head to the next space. Once you have passed enough spaces, you'll face an elite enemy. <clears throat> All right, the cat hoodie next one, next time, next time. Did I play Hawkeye Star? I used to play. Interested in what the other skill is going to be. You 
can upgrade its potential zone and improve a prototype. Oh, moves. so this is the road like, huh? I have been playing AFK Journey, yeah. Dash. Three times. You can spawn a crest at the starting location, additionally. Universal. Um, I think I'll go with this one. I guess it is like roguelike. It's like a saw. It's like a Ooh, nice. What is this? More stuff. Of course, you always go with the purple, right? I hope it's swift. I mean, not swift. I hope it's strain. No, actually, no, I don't know. I don't know about strain. There's too many that use this strain right now. Now I, now I think about it, I don't know what I want it to be. Kind of want it to be arcane at this point. <laughs> we have, we have too many that use this strain right now. It's supposed to be strain. Most, uh. Most uh, cookies that are frontline do use strength, except for Madeline right now. But but with so many of of the cookies using strength right now, Financier, Captain Caviar, freaking who is it? Who else? Who uses it? At least those two. Uh, those two though. Oh yeah, black raisin. Yeah, yeah. There we go. Yeah, with them all using it, I don't know if I want it. Uh, you can head to spaces of different types, where different effects will be in place. You know, I don't know if I want it to be a uh, strength right now either. Gamble exchange plus sixty points. When the max. Okay, funny. Oh, what is Yeah, we'll see how it goes. Dashing summons lightning bolt. If you have landed five hits with your attack and draw a lightning chain. I know, dude, there's so many, um, there are way too many, um, cookies that use strength right now. What's this? You can use exchange points to buy supplies. These exchange points are what you get upon defeating an enemy, and they only last in the current battle. 
リミッターを解除します。How is Genshin nowadays, though? I haven't played Genshin in a long time. What the heck? No, I have not played it before. It's my first time playing it. Ooh. Up J. Go airborne. What's up, Coconut Milk? It would be cool if uh, it's the new、uh, COK mode, right? Let's go with the religious. Eh, Umbra. Blades Blue Entropy Ent Entropy Entropy Effect? Ooh, what is this? Nice. Oh, what? I have to replace it? A rest space can restore HP to you. Yeah, I saw the eclipse. I took a video of it. My last healing. Demon Slayer? Yeah. I watched the first season, I watched a little bit of the second season. I just read the whole thing. I kinda, I kinda didn't keep up with the entire anime. 
But I mean, I did watch. I mean, I did read the whole thing. Yeah, no, I've been playing uh, Astro Knights of Beta. Yeah, I have been playing it. It's nice. It's it's a it's a cut full uh cool like thing. I just I just wish that they uh they went with a little different way. Feels a little greedy in a way. That game it's a. Uh, It's fun if you play casually, I feel. It, but if you're, uh, if you're a hardcore gacha gamer, it's gonna. The rates are gonna kinda suck for a lot of people. Oh, you, you, you know this is going to be a boss zone here. Oh, what the? Oh, okay. Yo, there's like a giant like thunderstorm or like something. Oh yeah, it is. <laughs> what the? Oh yeah, it's a, it's a bunch of rain today. <laughs> it was so loud. Oh my gosh. Well, there is no uh, tornado warning, thank goodness. I wouldn't want a tornado warning. Uh, it's a thunderstorm, though. Yeah. <laughs> 
fell. It's like a strawberry cream warning. <laughs> I know this this is not a uh this is not a phone game this is a pc game Next hit, I die. Ooh. Just have to be careful. Oh, yes. No, I don't play Honkai Star Rail anymore. Seems like they're not gonna make it uh earlier today, huh? Airborne and plunges diagonally downward to trigger a crest blossom. Not fair. Okay. 
Okay, I need that. I need that too. Combo HP recovery. Don't know what that is. Okay. Maybe it's uh, when I combo, I get some HP. Then. I know that. Please. I was like, scared me, dude. Heck is that, bro? Okay, okay, and I cannot stand on this thing. Thunderstorm was so loud. Holy crap. I hope my electricity doesn't go out. <laughs> so how many how many stages are there? It's a uh, blue blaze, yeah, or blaze blue, yeah. Alright, coconut and milk. I believe you. I am excited for the new candy and the new update. Or the new cookie. Whoa, that's so cool. I'm sorry, Leah, but I can't see. Crate fitness here in Elderfairy, dude. It's gonna be unkillable. Oh, jeez, dude. You've completed a mind training session. Speaking of which, I trust that you've spoken to Neo about the mind upgrade. 
Do me a favor, Acer. Wake him. You can adjust the difficulty of mind training here. Ooh. So what happens? If They, uh, the the thing? Yeah, I have no idea. Taokaka. Yes. Taokaka. Jin Taokaka. Can I un unlock? You can unlock what? From training adjective or in other yes. words? Upgrade. Ooh, does this guy get upgraded? Raising the mind upgrade level can unlock implant slots for mind crystals. Oh, nice. Mind crystals can improve the ability of your characters in mind training. By completing quests and defeating elite enemies for the first time on each entropy difficulty level, you can get fragmented minds. Um, yeah, I, I think I have enough almost to get to 30. I just haven't touched it. Do you remember the Evo type you generate? Yes, it will help each Evo type. The system will let you in on more. Acer, this is the voice message system of Ace. If you miss anything important, I'll make sure to leave you a message here. Highly efficient and designed for Acers who have already adapted to regular mind training routines. You have the prototype analyzer. Now you can unlock a new prototype. Do you guys hear? Are you guys able to hear that crazy sound? You can inherit from an existing Eva type to get their legacy, talents, and tactics. I'll be right back, okay? Oh no, there's a giant thunderstorm going on. Let me just check on it real quick. I'll be right back.
Yo. Yo, I cannot tell in my room, but the moment I step outside where it's like completely dark, right? It's insane. Is a level 30 um, fitness here worth it? Uh, yeah, I would say so. I mean... Oh, shoot. I feel like this... I feel like she's stronger than uh, the last one I played. Old J. are gonna be scared of that sound dude oh dude you're so fast oh what the frick yo what the hell is this I think it was a fighting game. Um, I think so. I think you're right. Oh, which is castle? I would need to download that again on, or not again. I would need to download it on the, on the emulator. But yeah, I mean, I can play it. I haven't played it in a while. see it still eight minutes it will be a uh, it will be a feature banner uh, the street urchin Project Sekai?
I know the cat did it. She is crazy, dude. Way better than the one that I just first played, dude. The the heck is that? Same, bro. I think that's just insane too. Ow. That was so much longer. What the heck? They extended it by 30 minutes, guys.
Well, that, that's I just just I just checked. That's why. Well, I mean, it is less. It's a. Uh, it's a. Uh, it was a less uh, of a duration of a, you know, maintenance than what it would normally was. So. Ow! I thought I had super armor. Oh gosh. It's called Blue. What is it? Blades Blue Entropy Effect? Dude. Sorry if, I, if I'm getting this name wrong, but I think that's what it's called. Blaze Blue Entropy Effect. There you go. Yep. That skill's so OP, bro. Ooh, advanced blade. Alright, toxin, toxin. I think that skill is just so OP. Mm. Let me rest a little bit here. A little bit more HP, you know?
Let's see the fails. Active Ascension. It's the robot boss, right? Oh, what is this boss? What the heck is this? No, no, no. Oh, man. Damn. This one. Yeah, not a bad run. Not a bad run. Did the cat girl? It's cracked. Insane. <laughs> Oh, I can unlock some crest. Whenever. Is there anything to get like. Is that heals? Oh, yeah, there we go. But completing a space cover. That's all I have for healing. Ooh. Oh, without taking damage, that's, that's hard. I think this is, I think this one's okay. Let's get this one. Dun, 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 dun. Challenge is a training program. Use your legacy to complete one mind training session. Who have already adapted to legacy? Is it just finishing it? Is that what it's talking about? Do I have to finish a run? Yes, Taokaka Jin Kisaragi Jin Kisataokaka. Nick 
Okay. It's on Steam, yeah. Oh yeah, yeah, I'm multi-streaming, yeah, yeah. Nice. Hopefully it's not delayed another time. something good okay I would say right now 30 uh, frost queen is better Oh, oh, oh. 
Man, I was trying to do it without getting I guess I, you thought using them next, but I have to use it. Oh yeah, yeah, that's uh, something like this game, yeah. Exactly. Is that the damage? Throw a ball upward and use this as a bicycle. Oh, it is a ball. Oh Binding of Isaac, that's a classic. Do you have another channel for like other games? Yeah, um, it's RA Gaming. Yep. That's where I post my other like gaming reviews and stuff. Finding amazing? No, I don't. I don't. I don't have it on this Steam account. I used to have it on my old Steam account. Keep the tone friend. And I have no I have no, I don't have access anymore. Uh right now I am or it's 318 AM for me. <laughs> uh, let's go with exchange. I did see the eclipse, yes I did. What was it? Oh, 
110. 100. Still have some time. Oh yeah, I played uh, Zenless a little bit on my on my channel. Use my s region thing. No, I didn't get to use this tree. I mean, the uh, HP mixture. Well, it did one shot me because my HP was so low. Yes, Ramuda Eleven. Yes, Taiju Kaishi. When was Super Epics? I don't know. Magic Candy Super Epic. I do have a Discord channel. Yes, I do.
Have you guys uh, um, seen the game uh, Stellar Blade? Stellar Blades is a PS5 exclusive. Yeah, it's a it's a RPG game. Three minutes. I hope they don't delay it again here. I think we don't have to update CRK. No, we do have to update CRK. I had to update it. It was not a lot, a big update, but you still had to kind of update it. Master Acorns, what's that? What's up? Thanks for the sub with the Prime. Seems like a boss here, and then. Oh, yeah, it's the giant dude. Oh, come on. Take me down. Updates here? Okay. Let's just die. Did 
We are, but we are to the here. Mind training okay. system. Next out of the game. Put this on full screen now. Alright. And we live. We've been live, but. Strawberry cream magic candy. Look at that. Alright. Good stuff to see. Alright, here we go. Here we go. I hope it's not a flop. Let's all hope it's not a flop. So I don't know why they got rid of the patch note. I, I don't I don't understand why they get rid of patch notes. Like randomly. Like what happened? Like the patch note was there and then it's just not there anymore. Alright, well there's that. So the cake shop is right over here. This you need to you need to talk to Strawberry Crate for the cake shop. It seems like. All right, I'm just gonna do the cleaning of it real quick. Cleaning up the town square. That's taking a very long time. We can just kind of do this. We got a thousand crystals, guys. We can wait at them. All right, let me just collect all these stuff. Is this strength crystals? Oh man. And there's the straight magic can uh create magic candy. Oh no. I don't want strength crystals. I still have not gotten this thing, bro. Like when when are they gonna give it to me? So we have these. Okay, we might have to do these real quick. Do, 
to get some more crystals, but we'll see how that goes. Well, let's do these real quick. Mm -hmm. All right, well, let's do gotcha real quick then first, yeah? All right, so Street Urchin Kagi gotcha. Dang, the music reminds me of a kind of like Black Lemonade vibe. Kinda. All right, well, let's do the gotcha here. Maybe we can get something good here, too. Maybe some more white. Okay, well, we got the Black Pearl from that. Kind of want a white lily, but you know, it's fine too. It's fine. All right. Silver bell. And I got opposite of white lily. All right, here we go. Street urchin cookie. Can we get in the first temple? I hope so. Never mind. All right, maybe from the singles here. Nope. All right, here we go. We got, what, 200 pulls? Should be able to get a decent amount, right? <laughs> Not gonna jinx it, but, oh man, here we go. Hiya. Okay, we're at nine soul stones now. All right, here we go, here we go. Come on. Let this be the one. Let this be the one. Dun, 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 dun. All right, it's a single. Come on, guys, hit that like button. Let's get this thing going. We can get it, we can get it. Come on, come on, come on. All right, come on. There we go. All right, there we go. I don't ride the wind. I cut right through it. All right, middle bomber. Finally, we got one copy. All right, let's try to get some more here and see uh, how how she is. Well, I mean, she gives you that, like, you know, the street punk vibe kind of thing, you know? Well, I, would I say she's worth the five-star ascension? I can't tell as of right now. I mean, I haven't even seen the numbers. Um, I'm literally getting it to one star, so we'll see how it goes. All right, come on. Come on, come on. Ooh, it's a double. All right. All right. All right. It's a double. Let's see here. Okay. First one epic. Street urchin. Good, good. Nice, nice. Five star promotion? Probably not going to happen. Fear gotcha tomorrow? Most, yeah, most likely. Or like. It will be 20 tomorrow for some. It will be uh, later in the evening for me. Yeah. All right, here we go. What's the next one? Street Urchin? Oh, that's a creme brulee. <laughs> Except I have you maxed. Creme Brulee Max is a no-brainer. Yeah. All right, we just need one more Soul Stone for a two-star. Oh, shoot. Okay, well. Dun, 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 dun. All right, come on, come on. Oh, oh, White Lily, please. As much as I like you, Pure Vanilla, I needed the White Lily. Aya. Oh man. 
Oh man. Oh, what's a veto? All right, well, we got two stars so far. It has been Pure Vanilla's anniversary. And it also has been my channel's anniversary, too. Uh, I, I think it was like two days ago. It has been my channel's anniversary. So it's been officially three years since I started making content on Pick Your Own Kingdom. Officially three years. Or more than three years now. Dun, 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 dun. All right, come on. She urchin. There we go. Bum, bum, ba, ba. Ba, 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 ba. It's three star now? Ooh, three star. Okay. Nice. All right. Two more temples, and that's going to be it, guys. Here's the last temple here. And it's two rares. That's lovely. What the heck is that? All right. Well, I, I think that should be okay enough for us to at least test, right? Would have been nice if we got more, but it's Nothing not a problem. I think that's a, a three-star promo. One star here. Where to next? Two star here. That could beat a super car. Oh, no, it was a two star. I needed one more copy, actually, to get it to a three star. So it's a two star promo. Yeah, we'll, we'll take it. We'll take it for now. We'll see how she is. All right, give me a second, though. I need to... Okay, so strength crystals, right? Nice. Thanks, Coconut Milk. Hey, Coconut, uh, do you, or anybody, uh, do you guys remember exactly how many, uh, purity crystal you need for, uh, Your curiosity protocols are intriguing. for you to get this thing to, uh, actually, I only need it to 10, really, right? Yeah, we just need it to 10 anyways. That's just, it's not like we're going to go crazy on it. All right, let's, uh, let's do this real quick. How many how many of the ingredients did you need do we need for us to get it to 10? What was that? Can you guys let me know how that how much that is? Seventy-four? Seventy? Should be enough then, right? right we'll leave it at that then. I think the cake shop you need to go through the missions. But let me let me see how what it is. Let me let me do this first real quick. Do the reviews and then uh, we'll go into the cake shop and stuff, okay? Let's 
Let's do street urchin first, and then... Okay. Alright, alright. Fine, fine, fine. We'll, we'll go We'll go into the pole here. What first? Crate magic candy review. Street urchin review. Story. Smash event. Review. Alright. You guys choose. What? Your watch stopped? Then go fix it, duh! Now I get it! Time to reconstruct you cookies! Man, you guys really love cream. Well, I don't blame you guys, but... Oh. Now hopefully pumpkin got pump pumpkin pie gets one next. Alright, well, magic candy it is, I guess. Let's do it then. Where is my crate? There it is. Cookies crumble too easily, but I can install upgrades. Alright, here we go. Strawberry Crate Magic Candy is finally out, and it is going to be using strength crystals here. Alright, uh, but let's look at this real quick. Crate Energy Blast. Alright, so it's going to add that extra little little beam at the end. All right, but Strawberry Crate Cookie releases uh, their Crepe Energy to push away enemies, reducing their movement speed and inflicting stun. They apply damage resist and HP shields to themselves and two ally cookies with the highest attack. Strawberry Crate Cookie then applies an additional damage resist buff proportional to their cooldown reduction. While Strawberry Crepe is using their skill, they will briefly re become resistant to interrupting effects. Alright, so we do have the little stun that has been added and the movement speed uh, decrease here. And also the big thing here is that additional to the uh, you know damage resist and HP shield to two allies with the highest attack, which was uh, actually before it was the lowest max HP. Uh, now we have highest attack, which is really, really good. It means that you're really focusing that DPS. And then also additional to that, you do get to have a HP shield on creep. All right. So that's a really, really good one. And the damage is as well. All right. So here we go, guys. Uh, let's look at the skill uh, effects real quick. Uh, and the, uh, you know, the numbers. Crate crash, skill area increase and resistant to knockback. All right. Target hit by the skill is going to be stunned for three seconds. And movement speed is going to be reduced by 35% for 10 seconds, it seems like. All right. Uh, they forgot the second. Uh, HP shield is going to be 10% of the max, uh, target's max HP for 12 seconds, which is not bad at all. That's, you know, very standard. Uh, and then damage resist is going to be plus 50% for 12 seconds, stacks up to one time. Of course, you, you know, that's the same as the regular skill. And then cooldown decrease proportional to damage resist increase. All right. Um... It means that, you know, uh, depending on how much cooldown you have, you're going to get some extra damage resist. It's going to be uh, minus 1%, all right? 1% of cooldown uh, is going to equal 2.5% uh, of damage resist, and it's going to max out at 15%, all right? Um, so that it means, uh, let's see here, 2.5%. It means that with 6% cooldown, all right, you're going to get that max eight, uh, max. So if you're using full on Swift Chocolate, it's going to be perfectly fine already. And then at plus 10, it's going to be additional HP shield, uh, which is going to be 10%, 12.5%, 15%. I'm really sad that Wildberry got a super crappy treatment My uh, with all that. For the prosperity of our kingdom. Like, yeah. You have to upgrade Wildberry's skill to get a extra HP and it's only for five seconds while strawberry crepe gets a you know just this right off the bat a 10% uh, was damaged I 
can try and repair them. Kind of sad. But here we go. Let's uh make this magic candy here, guys. And um let's uh let's see how creeps magic candy is. All right. So let's uh, make it up to plus nine first, and then we're gonna go into uh, plus ten, right? And then see uh, how much of the extra HP shield is gonna be applied here. By the way, you guys, if you guys are here and watching, if you guys can hit the like button, that would be greatly appreciated. I thank you guys all for coming and joining in, and tuning in to the live stream. You guys can do that for me. That would be awesome. All right, guys. There we go. Plus nine right there. All right. And let's uh, get this thing going. All right. Um, I am going to... just going to put this... I'll put this holobrae one in here. Extra cooldown is probably the better one. Uh, with, uh, you know, with strawberry crepe. But here we go. Let's go into uh, the, 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 the. Uh, let's just go to creep versus creep, I guess, right? Why not? We can do that. Let's get strawberry creep in here. Yay! There we go. I was so bored. And let's see what we the get here. Are my friends and family. Dun, dun, dun. All right, here we go. So if you can see here, we got that little laser beam. All right, shoot. All right, here we go. Laser beam one more time. We need to slow mo this time around. A little bit slower. All right, here we go. Laser beam time. Dude, it's crazy. All right, laser beam one more time. Pretty cool, dude. I'm not gonna lie. So much better. All right, here we go. Well, we got a creep versus creep, but we get the laser beam creep, and also that stun with the movement speed slow right there. All right, um, and we got the HP shield. It's you know lasting a very long time we got the uh damage resist down as well here all right so it seems like that's gonna be from the cooldown as well as the regular 50 percent right so we have that which is really really good honestly speaking i think that's a it's a pretty big uh increase overall because that means like even with the swift chocolate you're gonna get a ton of damage resist because it's three seconds start you get an instant Right, um, but something I wanted to test out here is we're gonna put in the uh, DPSs in here real quick, and then I wanted to see um, if if uh, this additional curiosity protocols are intriguing. I wanted to see if this additional cooldown, right, cooldown uh, damage is this increase, it's gonna be applied to everybody or just crepe, uh, or or just to the three of the cookies. All right, um, so let's see how that works, but we're going to go into plus 10 now first, uh, and then we'll go from there, all right? And it does seem like this is increasing the HP shield, which is even, that's even uh, worse for Wildberry. Man, Wildberry just got some crappy treatment, bro. So sad. <laughs> so sad for Wildberry. All right, here we go, guys. So first of all, uh, right here, we're going to use the uh, skill, which means that the damage resist is going to be applied to three. And it seems like the cooldown damage resist that, uh, you know, you get is also being applied to only these three. All right. So everybody else, like your healers, are not going to receive uh, the, you know, uh, the damage resist. Just the uh, three. So strawberry crepe and then the two of the cookies with the highest attack right so that's pretty much what we have got all right which means that like already that's what 50% and an additional 15 which that's like 65% cooldown 
course, uh, I don't know if it's going to be working as a uh, you know, straight number, like 50 plus 15, uh, but we have that. All right, so let's go into the arena now uh, because I feel like the combos that you know comes out now is going to be insane. Of course, I don't know if Hollowberry is going to be used, uh, but uh, we'll go for... Uh, now let's get rid of this one. I camera shoe is whatever now. It was worth a try. But uh, we are gonna go with strawberry crepe. Uh, first, I guess we can just go with something like something like this. And uh, we will go with the watch and the scroll here. That's a ton of damage resist. We get damage resist from the whistle, right? Uh, we get damage resist from strawberry crepe. We get damage resist from Elder Fairy. Jeez. You leave a scratch on That's a crazy. You deal with me. All right, give me a second. Let's upgrade this a little bit more here. Just a little extra HP shield, you know? Worth the shot, worth the shot. All right, here we go. Okay, but we're gonna put in uh, cooldown here, just like how we normally would do it with strawberry crepe. Still 15 second, right? Yep, still 15 second. Um, let's put infinite sears and see what, how that works for now. All right, so we got elder fairy, strawberry crepe. We got. Our uh, White Lily and Frost Queen with Snapdragon. You can definitely do Icicle Yeti too. Uh, it's probably going to be okay to do with Yeti as well. Uh, let's try uh, Let's try Snapdragon first and then we'll go with Icicle Yeti. Alright, uh, but I think Icicle Yeti is not going to be a bad idea either. Okay, I'm gonna have to verse some friends. This is a Not a lot of people are playing as much anymore, so there we go. Got some guild member here. Alright, first of all, this one is gonna be against the uh let's see, this is the one shot comp here. Mm, let's see how it goes. Let's see how the 50% does. All right, here we go. So we got Elder Fairy. We got Strawberry Creek with the 50% damage resist. All right. Oh, dang. Do we survive? Okay, we barely survived. The, I think the uh, Paper Charm kind of did get rid of the damage resist. All right. But it does seem like the, oh, the damage resist is definitely helping out in keeping our White Lily alive here. So... Okay, that that was that was kind of scary. That was kind of scary. All right. Um, this is still twenty, right? Kind of scary right there with the golden cheese and everything. Uh, but we did get to survive. Frost Queen did get to use skill once and died. But I mean, that once is going to definitely uh, be you know something. All right, we'll try with the different team. We'll get against the different team. It's Jorby here. This one is the. Okay, give me a second. You leave a scratch on a waffle bot, you deal with me. Dun, 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 dun. All right, so we'll try this time with. Uh, Finisir instead 
I need to put I need to put the toppings back then. Place this thing back then here real quick, and then for crepe, my you leave us. I will protect the car. What? Your watch stops. Take then go fix it. Shoes here real quick. Uh, we'll go with like crit percentage, I guess. Twenty percent. All right. There we go. So 50, uh, we got Swift Chocolate, Swift Chocolate, Swift Chocolate. And then uh, Raspberry with Swift Chocolate here. All right. Um, so let's see how this one goes. All right. Against uh, this comp right here. This is Jorby from our, this is one of my guild members. All right. Uh, we got the Paper Charm. Paper Charm. I guess the Paper Charm is kind of a counter in a way. Just because you get rid of all of the buffs. Right. All right, so you can see right here, the damage just does disappear because of the paper charm, right? But man, the HP shields, right? The damage is from uh, coming out from Snapdragon and everybody. But man, do we get to survive? Oh man, but. All right, guys, I think the Paper Charm is going to be a big, big counter to Strawberry Crepe, though. Yeah. You can see right there, all the buffs are just absolutely gets destroyed, right? And then, uh, yeah, our cookies are not able to do anything. So that is going to be a bit of a problem. The Paper Charm is just everywhere, right? All right, but we still have we still have hope. Uh, let's try. Except this time around, we'll try with Icicle Yeti as well, right? Uh, try Icicle Yeti here, and then uh, we will add in. Should we add in Frost Queen? How dare you stand in my way? Or should we add in uh, Finisier? Frost Queen, right? I think Frost Queen will be better. All right, we'll try against this one like this. Of course, uh, the Paper Charm is still going to, you know, uh, kind of get rid of a lot of the buffs, but we'll see how it goes. Let's go. It's basically replacing what? Uh, Finisier for Strawberry Crepe in this case. And then we actually do have the Jelly Watch and the Scroll while they have the. Uh... Oh, oh, wow. Yeah, they have the Paper Charm. Wow. Yeah, the Paper Charm is. Well, we, we know clearly that Paper Charm is going to be a problem, right? Paper Charm is going to be a big, big problem for Strawberry Crepe. I mean, it has been for Elder Fairy and others as well, right? But Paper Charm is a clear counter, at least. We know that for sure. Let's try against other, other teams as well, like a standard team. So there we go. This is going to be more of a standard uh, team with... You know, Elder Fairy, Strawberry Creep, and Financier. Man, this is a quad, like, quad front. And a White Lily Hyper Carry. Alright, uh, this one's uh, Coconut Milk here. So, uh, let's, let's see how this one goes, alright? Let's see how this one goes, like this. Well, we have uh, double DPS while it's a Hyper Carry. All right, here we go. All right, so we have the damage resist on uh, Frost Queen, White Lily, and our Strawberry Crepe. All right. 
The three seconds start with a tangle. Man, but the damage of the, the amount of damage Elder Fairy is taking. Alright, okay. We're good. We're still good though. Alright. Okay. Who's gonna win though? Oh, the 30 seconds. The 30 second White Lily Wand. The 30 second White Lily Wand. And also, I mean, it's a three star ascension of I Icicle Yeti as well. Uh, but uh, it does seem like we do have a little bit more cooldown, possibly, from, the, uh, from my friend's. Uh, strawberry crepe with the amount of damage that uh they are doing right now and it seems like yeah the white lily most likely has a swift chocolate build as well right but man it's crazy but yeah let's try now right so let's try now with the paper charm right so let's just literally put in the paper charm here like this and like this oh you have a nine second nine percent uh cd on crate oh so you didn't you didn't go with the uh three second start i guess it doesn't even matter huh because of all of this then what did you go with raspberry Oh, full damage is this. Okay. You still did more damage than me? It's crazy. All right, here we go. We'll, we'll, we'll try it with the paper charm, though. Let's go. All right, here we go. So, we have the paper charm, which is going to get rid of the damage of this buff, right? While we have the damage of this buff. So let's see how, how effective this is though. Paper Charm again. Boss Queen. Yep. Definitely the counter to Strawberry Crepe. And, you know, basically all the tanks right now is Paper Charm. See how much of a difference it makes, right? Like, man, all my cookies are alive. Yeah, just the, the, the amount of buffs you get doesn't matter it does not stand the chance against the paper charm all right uh so obviously a clear clear counter is if you see a strawberry crate or you see a ton of tanks just use the paper charm and you're good to go right there all right uh so there is that um but let's try against the uh um, let's try against this uh creme Blay comp here uh we'll just go with icicle yeti and then we'll add Infinity here as well uh, with the White Lily. This will be easy. And just see how this one goes here. It's time to play. All right, here we go. So if you see a Paper Charm, you just... So basically, you have to use... Um, Crimson Coral. Uh, so because some of the buffs that Crimson Coral gives, it's not, uh, it's not r like, you can't get rid of it, right, with uh, Paper Charm. So um, that's the reason why, uh, you know, Crimson Coral is not going to kind of disappear, right? Uh, but let's see here if we can survive the one minute mark Creme Brulee damage. Yeah, no, Creme Brulee still with that one minute mark. <laughs> Just absolutely destroys. We'll most likely win uh, if we replace someone like Financier with Frost Queen, most likely. Uh, but you can see the damage with this does help out a lot, though. Definitely does help out a lot. All right. Um, so there is that. 
Um, let's see here. This is the Crimson Coral Comp. All right. Um, so I'm actually gonna, actually gonna replace Finis here with Frost Queen. I kind of want to do use Frost Queen here. All right. So here we go. All right, here we go. Damage resistance is capped at, I believe, 85%. 80% or 85? I forgot exactly which number it was, but it's one of them. All right, there we go. We're still alive. We still got the damage resist. Our DPSs are taking a, definitely a lot less damage than they're supposed to, right? So, And then we have the HP shield as well. Oh, but dang, that damage at the end. So you could tell right here, right? The parfait with the, uh, you know, de uh, debuff immunity. Wow, we're still going to lose. I need to rest a while. Oh, my, oh, my. Yeah, the, the healing coming out from uh, the parfait still. Maybe we could try the, uh, let's try the quad, quad. Or should we try? Yeah, we should try, um, try Holiberry. We'll try Holiberry here. Let's hear it. But first, a toast. And then White Lily I with the strength for cookie kind. We'll try with the cooldown here. Let's try this. So we got Hollerberry in here. Man, Strawberry Crave didn't even get to use skill until the very end. But definitely having that debuff immunity and not having the debuff immunity does make a big difference. Right? You can tell. Elder Fairy is dead. But right, we got our Crepe and Hollerberry still alive here. The damage is this buff is up still. Oh, yeah. But having... I think uh, we should replace uh, one of the cookies with someone like Finn's here. Definitely having that uh, the debuff immunity and not having the debuff immunity does make a big difference in using our skills. So, let's try replacing Elder Fairy this time around with someone like Financier. It is my time to shine. I will protect the console. So we'll try it with this this time around and see how it goes. I think for Strawberry Crepe... Your confusion matrix uh, needs calibration. I mean, this is going to depend... I mean, I would love to use Almond. If I can just get a little bit more cooldown. Actually, no. We'll just use uh, Swift Chocolate and just see how it goes with that. Alright, here we go. So, let's see how this one goes. No, more hesitating. no we didn't do a review on uh, Street Urchin yet. All right, here we go. So this time around with the Financier instead of the Elder Fairy. Financier barely surviving right there. All right, but we do have the debuff immunity now against the uh, Frost Queen and the Entanglement. So that's good. So we have the Financier. All right. 
And we got the damage resist as well. So we got the strawberry crepe damage resist. We got the financier damage resist. Oh, but the damage coming out from the... Uh... Man. Still, still. The double DPS. <sighs> Hmm. Let's see here. Frost Queen. Must I do everything myself? Let's try with Frost Queen. Alright, here we go. So this time we should be able to. Oh. Never mind. Finis here didn't even get to stand the chance of using the skill in time. Dang. That sucks. Oh! Oh, but we did win. I will sing a song of victory. Hey, we won though. Finish didn't get to do anything, but we actually won this time around. The damage resist. The damage resist. Uh, we can try with Snapdragon 2 and see if, uh, we can use skill in time. Do you wish to be frozen? Oh, no, this is still kind of slow with it. Well, I wouldn't necessarily say crepes uh, are ten times better than Crimson Coral, but definitely like up against the uh, you know the regular standard comp crepe, you know, a bit better. All right, then uh, we're gonna also gonna try here exactly what uh, they are also using. Let's just go with the mirror comp, right? Um, I wouldn't necessarily... So here's the thing. I think in um, in the general sense, Crepe can be a replacement of uh, Crimson Coral. But I wouldn't necessarily say it is the absolute replacement uh, for Crimson Coral. I don't know if that made sense, but... It's a little bit different, you know. Calm down. You're cool. Everybody likes you. All right, here we go. So mirror matchup here. Oh my, my perfect just exploded. No, we gotta do a different mirror matchup because it seems like they're using a three second start, White Lily, right? It is full solid almond parfait. Wasn't it? Yeah, see, I am full solid almond. It's White Lily. So we should be able to see the Oh man. The white lily on the enemy team is just so much faster. Don't tell me it's a two second start white lily. Intoxicating. 
with the biscuit. Right? <laughs> it's a two second star white lily. I can't beat that. Yeah, there's there's no way you're gonna beat two second star. Yeah, sadly, I don't think I can beat that one. I'm gonna go with this one. Okay, never mind. We don't go with that one. Damn. Uh This one's a paper charm here. Let's see here. I guess we could try against this. Right? This crimson coral? Oh, it's a triple DPS. Ah, we'll just try it. All right, here we go. Oh. Well, I can't beat that one either, I guess. Yeah, CDS capped at 60%. Man, my Parfait just exploding here, dude. Oh, man. I'll do my best in battle. Okay, Isaku Yeti. Coconut, is yours? Yours is not two seconds star, is it? No, but Crimson Coral, I think, has a one second. All of us were born from the natural, embrace. natural one second. No, two second. That's why it's a little bit faster. So that's the that's the difference between crepe and uh, are intriguing. crepe and Crimson Coral. The White Lily skill will be like literally a slight second difference, which kind of destroys you. Uh, we can try with the Isaac Yeti, though. Yeah, I was so bored. Yeah, that's true. You can use ice, uh, Isaac Yeti with Crate. That's the uh, that is a little bit of a bonus that you get, but it doesn't help when your when your Parfait just explodes instantly. Oh man, dude. Hmm. Burnt cheese. Our enemies deserve no mercy. Burnt cheese or kind of want that I debuff immunity, right? No, crepe is good. No, crepe is good. It's just that there's a lot of different ways to counter it as as well as I'm just not really you know, optimizing it right now. There's just so many little things that come into play now. You gotta you gotta optimize in the biscuits and every little thing. So. I mean, I'm, I am versing, you know, a bit of more like, you know, higher accounts right now. All right, so here we go. Let's see how this one works though. So create, good. All right. So, wow, Elder Fairy still dies. All right, but we won this one at least. So Elder Fairy does work, right, with the extra uh, damage resist and the protection and healing and stuff. We're going to be able to keep our cookies alive. 
survived that triple DPS. And boom, there we go. All right. So, yeah, I mean, definitely Strawberry Creep is going to be worth And you're going to be seeing Strawberry Creep being used a lot. All right. Um, the 50% damage resist plus 15%. It's like 65. Let's just say 65% uh, damage resist on your cookies, including the tank and two DPS is insane and just keep in mind this is level 10 right now right additional to that if you can get you know plus 20 plus 30 then you're gonna get more hp shield you're gonna get more hp shield and more hp shield like literally hp shield is everything every single time you go and uh you know increase uh the level um so like i would say i would say um you know you're gonna definitely want to uh use uh, you know, strawberry crepe if you can. The only downside right now, I would say, is that it's strength crystal again, right? The strength crystal is gonna kill some people, uh, because you have strength crystal from strawberry crepe, you have strength crystal from uh, Finn and Seer, we have strength crystal right now from Captain Caviar, right? Um, and we have strength crystal for Black Raisin as well. So that's four of like the quote-unquote meta uh, epic cookies that you're going to need to use strength crystals. Uh, I mean, it it sucks, uh, but you know, you're going to have to grind those strength crystals, guys. All right, um, so that's pretty much what we have. I mean, there's so many different combinations now you can try out with Strawberry Crave because you don't have the restriction that Crimson Coral has, right, which is you only get to use one tank. Right, there's different combinations like this one. We have seen, you know, the quad kind of frontline tank as well. We can use the uh, Hollerberry in here. We can use Finn and Seer in here. Uh, you know, we can go with uh, just Frost Queen or just White Lily. There's just so many combinations. Uh, it's just that, you know, we know for sure Strawberry Creep is going to be used for the meta. All right, uh, we're going to have to see a lot of different variations. We might see, again, the uh, combination back uh, of Crepe and, you know, Hollerberry. But for sure, I would say get it up to plus 10. Um, honestly speaking, even without plus 10, I think you'll be perfectly fine. Uh, you know, you just get the extra HP shield. It's going to make a difference. Uh, but just by level 1, you get the 3 seconds stun. You get the movement speed slow. You get the 10% HP. You get the 50% damage resist. You get the additional 15% damage resist. So it's great. I, I It's like 10 times, almost 100 times better than uh, Wallberries. Sad to say. Uh, but for sure, Strawberry Creep Magic Candy is going to be 100% worth in my opinion. All right. Um, and yeah, I'll go and upgrade. Strawberry Creep is back. Just one counter. Paper Tron, right? Yeah, we don't talk about Wildberry's Magic Candy. I think Icicle Yeti has a natural one second start? Or two second start? Oh no, it doesn't. It has a three second. Um, even with Raspberry though, I don't think it's going to work out. Because you're going to have a three second unless you can get creeped to two seconds. Because of the natural 12. So even with Raspberry, it's not going to really work out too well. Alright, let's go into Street Urchin though. We gotta get into the street of oh, chant. It's urchin, right? Urchin, not urchin. Urchin. You better play nice when you're on my turf. Does damage resist bypass work in PvE? I mean, yeah, kinda. Pattaya, Capsaicin, and Abyss team. We'll, we'll see. We'll see how it goes. All right. So, latest epic cookie, Street Urchin. Um, hopefully, better than Caramel Shoe. All right. Um, I did promote to two-star uh, promotion already with the gotcha. Didn't get lucky enough. Uh, we only had 60000 to pull anyways. Uh, but let's go and level up Street Urchin here. Uh, to level 80 real quick 
All right, and we got the skill level to 80 as well. Good thing we have a ton of bomb, uh, bomber type uh, powder. All right, so here we go. Let's see here. Ride or crumble. It's a 12 second cooldown. Street Urchin Cookie rides her motorbike into her enemies, dealing damage, inflicting stun, and causing additional explosion damage if the target is, effect uh, is affected by burn. Her crit percentage increases and inflicts burn and fire type damage amplicate, uh, amplification debuff to enemies. If Street Urchin Cookie or her allies are affected by burn, her fire type attack damage increases. While Street Urchin Cookie is using her skill, she will briefly become resistant to interrupting effect. Man, I pointed this out in my video too. Why, why didn't they... It's inflicts, right? Unless I'm going crazy. You know, I thought I was going crazy. I searched this word up. It's not a word. <sighs> I, I pointed this out in my video. I wonder why I didn't, didn't uh, change it. All right, anyways, uh, the skill here, motorbike explosion damage is 785.9% of attack and additional explosion damage on burn targets, it's going to be 56% of attack. All right, not a ton of extra damage, but we do have some extra uh, ones uh, with the burn uh, targets. Uh, it's going to be a one second st uh, stun right here. All right, so we're going to get that one second stun uh, with the explosion. And the burn damage is going to be 150% every 0.5 seconds for 7 seconds. Stacks up to 2 times. Fire type damage increase is going to be 30% for 7 seconds. Stacks up to 1 time. And crit percentage increase is going to be 25% for 7 seconds. Stacking up to 1 time. This is a passive, guys. A passive. Fire type damage plus 8.5% when ally cookie applies burn to enemies for 7 seconds. And that's going to stack up to 3 times. And that means that we're going to be able to get a total of extra, what, like 25.5% fire type damage when ally cookie applies burn to the enemies. All right. Uh, so interesting here. Um, it does say that if, uh, let's see. If Tree Urchin, her fire type damage increases, are affected by burn. So I don't, I don't know how this works here. This is a little bit weird because it says if Tree Urchin Cookie or her allies are affected by burn, her fire type damage increases. But this it says fire type increases when applies burn. To the enemy am i going crazy or did they switch things up you think it's both all right well i mean i guess we'll try it out right don't think just test i like that i like that i like that Let's do it. I guess we'll just test it out and see how it works, right? And we'll find out if it's right or not. Dun, dun. All right, well, I mean, we'll, we'll find out, right? So let's go into... Okay, here we go. Alright, here we go. 
So we got the bomb, all right? So you see the explosion right there? Okay, good stuff, good stuff. All right, let's see here. And we're going to wait until the end. Boom. Okay, we just basically one shot at that thing. Boom. We got the burn right there. So we got the fire type damage up, right? Because we inflicted burn. Man. The wave? The wave clear on this potential the potential wave clear on Street Urchin is actually pretty crazy. Right. Okay. I like it. Alright, um, let's I guess we'll just go into the uh the arena and see how it works. Right? So I know you guys really, really wanted it, so we're gonna go and do it. Cap okay, Sason. Uh, but Daya. I, I, th I don't think this is going to be very good, but just try it out. I, I have a feeling more towards Alliance, though, for sure. For sure. Um, and then. Just go with Frosty. That's such a weird combination. No Pattaya. Uh, we'll go with crepe. Uh, Whoops. What are you expecting? Me yeah, I was so bored. I'm done holding back. I'll burn it off. Burn it off. Bring on all the spies. It's no problem. Cream unicorn. Want to see cream unicorn? Uh, Cream Unicorn's magic candy has a burn effect and increases fire type damage. That's the reason why people are saying try with it. I mean, it's not a horrible idea, but I don't know how good of an idea it is either. Unicorn instead, man. That's like you getting rid of all the, all the the DPSs. <laughs> you getting rid of all the DPSs. All right. Well, what's the worst cream unicorn? Cream unicorn. Where are you? Oh, I didn't even level up cream unicorn. That's crazy, dude. By the way, guys, this is a joke team. Don't use this team at, uh, for reals, though, yeah? For reals, for reals, don't use this team. Oh, shoot. I messed it up. I should have just taken it out from Car Caramel Shoe. Let's go back to Ross Cream real quick. Have no fear. All shall follow the will of nature. Okay, real quick. All right. Well, don't know how well this is gonna work, but we'll just try it out anyways. Guess, yeah. Against this, we'll try this. All right, here we go. Fire time damage, burn. Oh, jeez, cream unicorn just exploded. Street urchin explodes too. Not gonna happen, guys. Not like this. All right. Well, we're gonna take out Cream Unicorn. It was it was just a fire type damage team, right? All right. Uh, let's use Pattaya instead. Feel the fiery of a I never say no. 
no to a challenge. I guess we'll ascend as well. Do. That. Let's just use. Hey, calm down. You're cool. Get the name yeah. on the light. Are we solid almond? The duty of a knight to uphold civility and order. Rockstar. Okay, that's a that's a. It's not a bad idea because we do have the crit increase, right? Maybe Rockstar. We'll can try Rockstar. Let's try Rockstar. Oh yeah, I have to uh, level up it. Rockstar, the time. Rule the world. My strength is beyond your imagination. You stand before the Dragon of Legends. The Dragon of Legends. What? I'm the icon of rock music. Hmm. Do I put in though? The Swift Chocolate build? We always go with classic straw, uh, classic Swift Chocolate build. Okay. Oh, shoot, but I need a crit percentage, right? Let's hit the stage. It was 5% crit, right? Shoot. this was gonna work but we'll just try it we're gonna just try it all right we're gonna go against this one all right holiday elder fairy finance here let's go So we got the fire type damage up, right? And our rock star explodes instantly. And our tree urchin also explodes instantly. One minute mark, fire breath, not gonna do much. Finisir will block burn. Yes, Finisir will block burn. Uh, because of the debuff immunity. It's a debuff immunity, right? So you're going to block burn. I think... Ah, no, it will, I, I think it can work. Just... Man, there's so many... So many different things that come into play. Let's try it. Yeah, let's try a Paper Charm. Uh, stand. We'll just go with this. No, that's so slow, though. We don't have enough sustain, so go with this. Possibly. And I don't know if you could beat this one, but oh, this was also a paper charm. All right, we'll go with that. There, here we go. Oh, 
Yeah, but you can see right there, Finisier buff on that Frost Queen is blocking all of the, uh, all of the, uh, you know, burn effect. This sucks. Music. Let's just use Finisier instead. Well, for sure, she's going to be using Cookie Alliance. Um, I can I can see her being using Cookie Alliance. In the name of the light. Oh, we got to try it in the arena too, you know? scary one but we go against it anyways all right um i don't know if i want to yeah not this just just capsaicin then it's here and frost me. Must I do everything myself? Honestly, I don't even think you need capsaicin. You can probably just go with like Eternity is an illusion. This and I don't know. Crave. <gasps> so do I just or smash everything? Elder Fairy. Lead me. That's a really fast. Wah! Whoa, you saw that? You saw Shri Urchin just literally explode? Even before she can use skill? She literally just, she went back and then she exploded. Like there was nothing more. That was it. That's all we saw of her. That's hilarious. No, I don't think her skill dodges either. There's too many skill nowadays that just prevents you from dodging, to be honest. <laughs> There's that too. Uh, we can try and uh, quote-unquote one-shot type of build, I guess. Uh, let's see here. So we can try with burnt cheese. Faithful jackals. Uh, rebel. I mean, but it's like, hey. who do you, who do you, uh, who do you replace though? Do we go with Frost Queen? Your life will be shattered. I guess we can try with Frost Queen. Yeah, new DPS is hard. <laughs> Definitely can be used in like... You know... Definitely can be used in... Uh, Seems like uh even the wind and clouds are on my side. Uncle down, cool down. I can do so much more if I train harder. <laughs> I 
What's up, Lucky Charm? Alright, well, we'll try it out. I don't know how it's gonna work, but... Let's go! Rebel, Street Urchin, Frost Queen, and they're all Frost immune. My burn she's not two seconds. My duty is burn she's just two seconds, right? In order or chaos. Oh no, I have to. Don't worry, my friend. Icicle Yeti needs to get out of this. When has Firecom been good? Nah, really, yeah. Okay, here we go. Kinda, kinda, there we go. Okay. Okay, now we try against uh, friends. Can we win? That is the question. Can we win? I don't know. I don't, I don't trust that one. Cranberry Lake Hop. How was that? Super scary, right? All right, here we go. Get the little stun effect, right? The Cranberry survived. Okay, okay. All right, all right, all right. But the thing is, do you use this or do you just use golden cheese? <laughs> Like, like, why, why go for this, right? When you have golden cheese, or when you could be using golden cheese, right? They'll be done before I pop my bubble gum. The debuffs are cool, but like when you're going up against a lot of teams with already big debuffs, like 
you know, you don't necessarily need it, you know. Like you're you're not you're the, the this is not doing the damage. This is doing the damage, you know. Yeah, this one seems a, a bit hard. <laughs> we'll try it out in a guild, though. I didn't even need my guild boss battles too. Oh, I've been slacking. Oh man, everything is all messed up. All right, Bataya. All right, whistle. Nothing can stop me. I'll overcome any of the merry-go-round awaits. What's the what's the team you you suggest here? Well, I, I, I wasn't even expecting her to use an R, RVD, though. She just doesn't look very good for RVD. Mala? 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 Mala sauce. Oh man, I gotta increase mala sauce too. Forget the bird. I'll become so spicy that all of our tribe will want to take after me. I keep the tip in the end. Scovilia, weak? No way. We're no just way. getting started. I don't know what toppings though. Would you know the stars shine if you didn't look at the night sky? Just go with some random toppings for now. No two stars in the world are the same. All right, fire comp. Honestly, I don't even know what, how to do the skill order for this anymore and what I should try for this one. Well, let's just do it. I guess we'll just see how it goes. We got the damage resist anyways. Yo, are we killing the blob? Yo, we're killing the blobs. Oh, yo, that is a no-go then. If you kill Blob, it's a no-go.
Oh my gosh. Yeah. Hmm. Sadly, guys, I think it's like you only use it really for waves like, you know, in Cookie Alliance. It, it really feels like they made the last three cookies just like barely usable in certain situations. And like, I don't know, like she's she's cool. I feel like. I feel like this is getting you ready for the beast raid. Again, again, the beast raid, they specifically said that the elements are going to be very, very important. And looking at it, it does seem like the beast raid, if the, the beast is going to be uh, for, you know, the fire type damage, then uh, it, it, there's, a, there's a chance of, you know, street urchin and cookies like these coming into, uh, you know, the usage like um, butter roll with the attack speed slow or whatever it is you know the debuffs that are going to come out uh, but it seems like they're not really geared towards what uh, we are expecting with like you know meta changes uh, the DPS is right now inside of world uh, not world expression inside of the arena right now is just too hard to cover up because you know we have white lily we have frost queen right uh these and we have golden cheese uh these three are just way too good uh strawberry cream is great uh in the fact that it's kind of like crimson coral except uh you don't need to only use crepe as the front line right uh, so I, I i feel like right now what we're what we're seeing is they're transitioning towards like releasing cookies that are not as impactful inside of the arena and things and then getting you guys possibly ready for the beast raid that is going to be coming out, right? Um, and uh, we'll see how it goes uh, because we had Macho with poison, right? Uh, I mean, we had Camo Shu with like just decent, 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 uh, you know, uh, effects and buffs. We had, uh, you know, Butter Roll with decent effects as well. Uh, but and then now we have street urchin with fire type damage so we'll see how this one goes um but it's, you see it feels like you know you can use uh ur street urchin for the cookie alliance with the fire type team and things like that um but besides that inside of world exploration you can use uh street urchin but arena and a, you know guild boss battle probably not going to be the case here um and yeah you're probably just get one copy and i think you'll be okay like you'll be perfectly fine uh filler up there it seems like another one uh, except for street uh except for uh man i can't even talk except for uh strawberry creep here and uh just another update to kind of farm your crystals and get ready uh for the big one to come uh, hopefully uh, with the next update right so yeah street urchin decent again pve world exploration uh and the cookie alliance but inside of arena uh and the uh, guild boss battle especially probably not gonna be the case uh i will update you guys if there are any comp that does come out with street urchin though all right <clears throat> all right let's go into let's see here It is pretty much like a crepe update. All right, let's see how to unlock. Oh, barely drop by. Okay, well. didn't tell me exactly how though see so, yeah, maybe we need to do some quest and it all it unlocks oh is it the 13th actually they're actually 
Man, they're actually timing it with the stinking actual like collaboration effect event. There's no way, dude. Where's the upcoming event? I don't even see it. Unless I'm stupid. Oh, it's in the other event. Oh, shoot. Sorry. Event. This event, right? Where is it? Ah, shoot. Oh, no. That's in like, what? Four days? One, two, three. Oh, it's in three days. Oh, man. Why they do that? Why Why they do that? Man, they even extended the uh, update and they can add the cake shop. Come on, brother. Come on, dudes. This was another like very 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 like slow boring update. Not gonna lie. I don't know about you guys. Yeah, whistle. But no, I agree, I agree. She's she's good for alliance. She's definitely gonna be better for alliance and stuff, but Definitely not uh, what we were kind of hoping for, right? I I guess, in a way. Oh man, to do the petition board thing with Jiggy. All right. Well, anyways, I guess. <sighs> Dude, I I. I need them to make a a good update next time. Next next update has to be a good one. Like we need it. We need it. Right? Oh man. You can change cookies too though. To White Lily. Ooh, nice. Settings. Alright, I need to do the keyboard mapping here. Wait, 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 wait. The mapping. New custom. Anyways, all right, let's see here. All right, sure. Okay, gotta get the jellies. Those count as jellies? All right, this count as jelly. All right. Oh man, I pressed a little bit too much. Man, they needed a little bit more uh, exciting music. The petals are scattering in the wind. Ch -ch -ch -ch. 
Man, there's a lot though. Holy crap. Definitely more co uh, costumes right now, too. Oh, it's the same, uh, same run, though. It's just different missions. It's the same exact run, boo. Same exact run. Destroy 40 obstacles. It's so repetitive. I'm not going to lie. Oh man, that was easy. That's that's what it is. There's nothing really special about it. Oh man, I need the next one to be big, man. These are these are kind of disappointing, dude. <laughs> These updates are so disappointing. Thirty wishes. Yo, they hinted at Win Archer so many times too. I don't know where Win Archer is. Right at this point, I feel like you can just release Win Archer too. But no, not yet. They say. Well, I don't know about Shadow Mill coming out right now. Shadow Mill coming out right now might not be the best. But for sure, I feel like they should release something. Elder Fairy's been gone for a while now, too, so. Or like two, two, no. Oh, has it been only two weeks since Elder Fairy has been gone? We do need more dragon as well. I agree. I don't know where our dragons are going. Where our dragons are. That, I mean, that's what I, I, I specifically said, right, before, too. I think Death Sisters need to capitalize on what they're good at. The story. The, you know, the, the, the story that they have built. The lore that they have built around this universe of Cookie Run Kingdom. You know, it's different from Cookie Run Oven Break. They need to, they need to expand on the lore. I feel like that's what they need to... They need to capitalize on and again with the new town square i feel like there's so many new potential 
events and uh, mini games and stuff like that that could come out. They just need to, they just need to not let this opportunity go by. Like, yeah. Ah, oh, shoot! What did I do that for? Uh, Street Urchin is not terrible. Uh, but terrible. Uh, well, let me let me just. I'll, I'll say PvP. She's pretty terrible. PvE. She is pretty good. But that's it. Well, I mean, uh, I would say oven break is a little bit easier to just create cookies and, you know, you just kind of throw the cookie into the running theme. Like, you don't need to, you don't need to come up with like, you know, you don't really need to think about the different impact one cookie could have on like, you know, different things. I mean, I'm not an oven break player, but I feel like it's just a little bit different in uh, coming up with the lores and stuff. But I mean, I think that's not like any any excuse, though, to, uh, you know, be lacking in in this particular case of like, you know, not so entertaining updates. But, you know, yeah, just my thoughts. Well, I mean, I agree. Fillers are needed here and there, but I don't know if a filler like this, this long is needed. You know what I'm saying? This is taking a filler to the to a whole different level. <laughs> I mean, I like I like them doing it, new things. Like the world events uh, was cool. Uh, died out pretty quickly. Um, I think. You know, uh, the the town square is pretty cool too. But again, I just feel like there's you can't just keep, you know, yeah, can't just keep throwing at us the fillers. Well, you say it's fourteen days, but you know, I feel like this whole entire month is filler, right? I don't know if we had longer filler filler than this. We had constant update though. So, I mean, I I, I think it goes both ways. Again, we we don't have the whole update. Like the cake shop is not coming out until the 12th. Right? Yeah, exactly. The entire month of March was kind of filler. And then now the beginning of like April to the end. Um, uh, not really. I mean, you can't really consider like the special episodes. Uh, it's like so. So, so see, special episode types are good fillers. You know, new cookie comes out that that those are pretty good. There's new lores that come out, but like these are like, eh, I don't know, man. Could just be me, but.
different approaches uh, to how fillers work, in my opinion. I'm guessing they wanted to add the cake shop with the um, with the new uh, collaboration event thingy that they're having. I don't know. Yeah, like the Pattaya story was great. I mean, Icicle Yeti story was pretty, you know, unique too. Uh, we had the Soda Island, which was or the festival that was pretty cool. You know, the Mermaid's Tale. You know. I just feel like it's like, you know, those kind of fillers are good. Like we get, you go, we get new stories, we get new lores, uh, you know, people have things to do, uh, you know, there's a lot of rewards and stuff, but I don't know. It just depends on how we look at it, I guess. Anyways, um, I'm going to end the live stream here for this one guys i'm gonna edit some videos and probably sleep a little bit before i have to go out later to uh do something uh 5 22 a.m <sighs> anyways i will uh upload the street urchin if you guys are here for street urchin i just would just let you know not bad uh but not gonna be used for any of your arena battles most likely i'll update you guys if there are anything uh, that comes up but that's pretty much what we have gotten thank you guys all for joining i appreciate you guys if you guys find anything you guys can always message me on discord make sure to hit that like button if you guys can before you guys leave all right uh let's try to get up to that 300 350 mic um and i will also be posting a community post soon uh about q a's all right uh for the 200k sub uh special thing that i wanted to do a lot of people did ask for q a and i'll probably do it uh I don't know. Maybe I'll do some cooking as well. Uh, but thank you guys all for joining. I appreciate you guys being here. All right. And I will catch you guys all on the next video. All right. Or next live stream. Whichever comes first. See ya. See ya. See ya. No one.